your supermarket boy. How's that going, by the way? Oh, that didn't take. Well, I'm sorry. You really get through them, don't you? I guess it looks like that. Well, I guess you were only young once. I'm bipolar. Really? Yes. I have been since I was 15. How come you never told me? <laughs> what? Who wants to hire someone with a mental illness in entertainment law? <laughs> Are we crazy enough? <laughs> Sorry. So why are you telling me now? Because you're more than work. And you should know what you're dealing with if we're going to see each other outside the office. Which I would like. But I have incredibly low periods. So low that I can barely move. I am impossible to be around. I can barely answer the phone. I can be totally unreliable as a friend. In fact, in some ways, I can be probably the worst friend you could ever have to check a single box. I have a meeting in five minutes. Okay. Phyllis, hi. Those guys from Adamy in my office tell them we have to cancel the day. I will see them tomorrow. Yeah. And tell them I'm really sorry. You want to get lunch? We're gonna get a menu. So where are you right now, mood-wise? Coming off of a low. Tonight I'll be pretty panic. You're the first person I've ever told about this. How does it feel telling me? <laughs> like an elephant is taking one of his foot out of my chest. <sighs> I'm so glad you told me. Ex explain so much. If anything, now knowing made it a little difficult to connect with you fully, the way I would have wanted. <sighs> so you want to go get a drink sometime? You want to go to the movies? You, you want to see people? All of the above. You are the most fun I have ever been around. I'm not letting that go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.